Hello, my name is Craig Crawford of course and welcome to the Graphics Automator demo. This is a quick demo to show you how the Graphics Automator works and what you can do with it and how perfect it is for you. So obviously once you go to plugins you add it just like you would a usual WordPress plugin and we will have tutorials to show you from A to Z of how to actually do everything step by step. Once Graphics Apocalypse plugin has been added you activate it this one's already been activated and then on the top left hand side you click the graphics apocalypse little icon tab once you do that it will take you to here this is the different category shown and obviously the self-explanatory business characters discount stickers doodles guarantee badges and so forth you can add a new category this is where it's really cool you can upload your own graphics into this plugin to keep and store for as long as you want and where you want you can move the plugin with you this is kind of like a briefcase in a weird way if you, if you want to if you want to think of it as that way that's not what this plugin is made for this is just part of it that's the awesomeness so that's just how you add a category anyway the images this is the main coolest part if you see here you have the business characters the name the image and the action here is where they are kind of imagine this to be a menu these images all of these images that you see let's go to the next one next we can keep going and as you can see there are many 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 images keep going all of these are stored on our server so this means that there's no holding back your website your website can run as freely as it wants and there's no clogging it up with too much memory taken up so you basically you choose whichever one you desire let's use this image if you want to look for I don't know a guarantee badge uh, it shows up already in the search like there's a search kind of engine on the top right hand side let's use this image shall we yeah let's use this one this one and this one there is an option for you to download all of the images from our server into your server but if you want it to run at its optimum or however you want to run it you can always use our server and just choose whichever images you wish to insert into your plugin how cool is that so now we've done these, I will show you how to add them to a page or a post. Remember all of this is going to be taught to you step by step. Mm -hmm. 